Hello my beauties and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today's video is super exciting because I'm going to be trying out The Art of Magic from V Cosmetics. Um, full transparency, I did receive this gifted from Lindsay the brand owner and oh, V Cosmetics is a brand that I've supported for a long time. I love the products from V Cosmetics. I have a ton of palettes. So this is the Art of Magic. Look at the artwork. I love how simple but effective that artwork is. And then this is the inside of the palette. They're all super sparkly, shifty, beautiful shades. I will pop a little video I did of the swatches up so that you can see that if i move over a little bit just to make sure there's room for it um but yes so this is the palette the art of magic um the shade names um read along so you've got never hide your magic you are a true magical being and love is your art form so as you can see that they just that's how how she does it i love that i love the there's always kind of a, a motivational quote. I love it. Um, so yes, this retails for £35. That is British pounds. I do have a discount code with V Cosmetics, which is affiliated. So if you do use my code, thank you so much. It really helps me out. Um, my code is not your basic stuff. It will be in the description box below. Yes. So this is a limited edition palette. So yes guys, if you would like to see how I created this look, then just keep on watching. Okay guys, so I'm super excited to get going. I'm quickly just going to let you know, um, I primed my eyes with the P. Louise base in Rumor 02 and for my brows I used the V Cosmetics Bewitching Brow Pomade in the shade Storm Clouds and Lavender Fields. Um, I did buy this myself, this is my first time trying it, I'm liking it so far, so I will update when I've tried it a few more times, but so far so good. Um, I'm going to quickly, I'll make it go quick for you guys, but I'm going to quickly pop on some mattes from the V Cosmetics Blood Moon palette, so this one here, so I'll do that quickly and then we will get going with this beauty. Okay, so now we've got the mats on. I just felt like being a little bit extra today and the mats in the Blood Moon palette are super easy to work with. Super pigmented. I love them. So, yes. Let's now jump into The Art of Magic. This is the palette that we are showcasing today and I love the packaging. And these are the colours. Um, you will have seen a video of my swatches. I am going to first, I think, I'm going to go into magic first. And I'm going to place that on this, like the outer area of my lid here. This is a stunning shade. Look at that. That is beautiful. 
I think most of these have a shift in, most if not all. Um, they look stunning, absolutely stunning. This blue is beautiful. I am using a kind of flat but fluffy brush. I do tend to find with a lot of the more sparkly shades that it works better for me picking up the shadow. But that is so pretty. Yeah, if you are having trouble picking a shimmer up with just a regular flat brush try getting a more fluffy flat brush because i definitely find that helps me a lot Ooh. that is super pretty look at that okay so i think next i'm gonna go into never which is this shade here and I'm going to pop never across the middle the middle part of my lid and again I'm using a, a flat but fluffy brush oh oh that is so pretty kind of like blue to purple That is gorgeous. I think this one might actually be my favourite shade in this palette. It is so pretty. And yes, I'm saying that and there are greens in here and greens, greens are my favourite. Green's my favourite colour. But this shade is super stunning. Look at that. Can you see? I hope you can. Yeah, I think this is definitely my favourite shade. Oh, I picked up loads of... It blew, blew away. It's all good. Look at that. That's super stunning. okay 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 and then i think for the inner part of my lid i'm gonna go into you which is this shade here and again another kind of flat but fluffy brush just smaller and that's gonna oh well i was not expecting that much pigment from having swatched that is so pretty oh yes this palette is a bit off me i do love shifts and oh. look at that i'm just kind of tapping it into the shimmer next to it just so that we get the blend, which has been no issue whatsoever to get. Ooh. Okay, that is stunning, absolutely stunning. I'm just going to go back into the Blood Moon palette and I'm just using, I should have said what shades I used really shouldn't I um so I've used serve with and be true so I'm just going to go back in with some more of serve just to deepen close it deepen the, the outer area there That. 
These mats are beautiful. If you're looking for an all matte palette with these shades in, I would highly recommend this. Um, I did buy this myself. I've been buying products from V Cosmetics since, gosh, right at the beginning of my channel, if not before, I'm trying to think. Right at the beginning, anyways, at, at the least. And this is one of the best that she's come out with. I absolutely adore this. But yeah, so this is the Blood Moon. It's gorgeous. Um, yeah. Okay, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to quickly nip off and pop a base on. And then I will come back and we'll do the under eyes together. But I am loving this so far. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. So yes, two seconds and I will be back with you. Okay, so my base is on and we are going to go in with the under eyes. I'm going to first go in with a true shade here. Oh, dig my nail in everything apparently. Um, I'm just using like a slightly fluffy pencil brush. I'm just wanting that on the outer part of my lower lash line. that and it's only like a really small area but that is beautiful I'm just gonna I should be being more careful seeing as I've done my base but apparently I don't care that looks so pretty And the same on this side. I should have sprayed my brush really. But, oh well. These things happen. And it's green so I'm more than happy to paint everything green. Ooh. That's looking pretty. And then I'm going to go into magical for the inner part of my lower lash line I think this is going to look absolutely stunning so I'm just going to try and do it so that you can see better look at that that is that is gorgeous look at that green Oh, okay, yeah, that, that looks stunning. I'm just going to pop a bit more on. Okay, I am loving how that's looking. I'm just going to do the inner corner and brow bone highlight. And I'm going to go in with our, again, using a slightly fluffy pencil brush. Ooh. That looks stunning. Look at that. Super pretty. I'm just gonna top that up a bit there. That is gorgeous. I'm just gonna pop a little bit of that up under my brow just to highlight up there. 
try not to pop too much. Okay, I think I'm going to use that as my face highlighter as well. Um, hmm. Look at that. That is looking beautiful. Okay, I'm going to nip off and finish my face. And then I will come back and show you the finished look. And have a quick, quick chat about the Art of Magic palette by VE Cosmetics. So if you would like to see that and hear that, then don't go anywhere. Okay guys, so I'm back with the finished look. I'll come a bit closer so you can see. I'm super happy with how it looks. Before we have a chat about the palette, I'm just gonna let you know a couple of the bits that I popped on my face. Um, the bits that were V Cosmetics obviously were the brow pomade. Um, I did use the, what you called Ritual Primer for my face and the Graveyard Dirt Loose Contour, love this. Um, in my waterline, I use the Made by Mitchell All Smudge No Budge Liner in Pink Drink. My lashes are from Meggy Lashes, Cat Like is the style, I love these. Um, on my lips, I have the V Cosmetics liquid lipstick in the shade Misty. I don't believe she does this shade anymore, but there is one on the website very similar, if not the same colour. Um, but yes, I love this and I think it went perfectly with this look. Um, for blush, I went into the Blood Moon palette from V Cosmetics. I nearly threw it at myself then. And I went into shade Be True. Obviously very lightly, but I like how it tied in the look. And then for my highlighter, I went into R from the palette, Art of Magic palette. Okay, so let's have a quick chat about this beauty. So as I should have said at the beginning, I haven't actually filmed the beginning yet. Um, this does retail for £35, that's British pounds. Um, I do have a discount code with V Cosmetics, which is affiliated. That is not your basic stuff. It will be in the description box below. If you do use my code, thank you so much. It really helps me out with my channel, just in picking up new things. Um, but yes, the Art of Magic palette. This is limited edition from the main line, not from the budget range and oh, love the artwork and i love these shimmers they are stunning um i will make sure in the intro to pop the video i did swatching video of the swatches in natural light oh guys i love this and i am not saying that because i was gifted it I'm saying that because it looks stunning and V Cosmetics is a brand that I've supported for a long time. I have so many of her palettes. Um, yes, there's only three of the palettes I have out of the many were gifted to me. Um, so yeah, I love this brand and it's a UK indie brand, vegan, cruelty free, vegan owned. Lindsay is amazing and yeah, this palette's no exception. It's another beauty. So I should just quickly show you the inside one more time. If I come up close, I can do this. I don't know if that will help with seeing any shifts, but you'll see them in the uh, in the swatch video. So yes, I think that is about it for me for today. Everything I have on my face will be listed in the description box below for if you wanna check that out if you want to know anything i've used um if you have enjoyed this please do give this video a like because that really does help me out if you are returning thank you so much for returning i appreciate you so very much you have no idea 
If you are new, I hope you'll consider sticking around, subscribing so that we can hang out some more. I would absolutely love that. Um, and yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you're all having a great day, great evening, wherever you are and whatever you're doing. I hope you're taking care of yourselves. I will see you again very, very soon. Goodbye. Stepping in the spot like she own it Looking like the world is your runway She can set it off like a gunplay Oh my, yeah Talk of the city with the body Always getting praised like it's Sunday She said, baby, what you gonna do?